What's going on guys? Auditing America here. I'm with Chase from the Allen Report and we're doing a First Amendment audit. We're at the Putnam Police Department in Connecticut. We're gonna see if they respect their First Amendment rights to video record in a public place. Please share, like, and subscribe to all of our pages. Shout out to Bucket Boy News. Make sure you check them out. Okay. Oh, it's over here. They're hiding behind this wall. Oh my God, this. What are you? What are you gonna ask for? Public records request. Yes, yeah, so I was wondering if we can access a public records request form, please. As soon as you're available, no problem. As they're, soon as he's available, guys. They're not available right now? No. Uh -huh. They could be busy. I guess that applies both ways. Both ways. All contact with Auditing America is subject to audio and visual recording. Share, like, and subscribe. Well, guys, as you can see, this is a very, very, very small police lobby. Um, pretty cold in here, too. They're pretty, they're pretty much hiding behind this glass right here. I don't know why, it seems very creepy. But we're doing a public records request and we're gonna find out some information about internal affairs. Got a nice camera right up there. Thank you very much. Do you have a pen? Uh, Can I have a no pen. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Huh? Oh, I don't think that's how it works. That's <laughs> definitely not how it works. We're gonna find out. Okay, hold on. Let me ask. Ask for a pen because we actually don't. Have Hi, are you a police officer? Okay. Can I can I speak with the police officer, please? Um, a sign that you guys have right here in the front. Yes, sir. An attention sign for all the individuals entering the building. Well, well, I mean, I mean, a police officer just gave me a public records request right now. He just handed it. We need a. Uh, okay. I still look okay. So, how long do you think that will take? So there's not a single cop in this building right now. Can you ask for a pen? Okay, thank you very much. Right. You said we're welcome to take a seat and a police officer will come speak with us. But that they're very they're very busy right now. Which is understandable, but yeah, what I don't understand is how this sign that they have right here it says mm -hmm. all individuals entering this building are subject to search of their person and or belongings 
which means, Chase, that we have absolutely no yeah. Fourth Amendment. You have no right. You could The police could just say, oh, I'm just going to search you. I'm just going to search you because I want to search you, which makes no sense because you have to have probable cause or, re- you know what I'm saying, reasonable yep. suspicion. You need, you, no, you're right. They need probable cause in order to search anyone. You have to be suspected of committing a crime. Are you... We're going to make sure this gets taken down very soon. Well, we have to talk to the mayor about that. That's a little, uh... Yes. It's good that we came over here. January 22nd, so... Can you scoot over a little bit? So many points in half. Uh, yeah. uh, perfect time. You know what I'm saying? Request the last five internal okay. affairs investigations I'm completed. Huh? I'm going based on the unconstitutional crime. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Actually, forget the, the internal yeah. affairs. Do this. We'll do the internal affairs one later. So the name involved, the Putnam Police? Um, You want to... No, I know, but Mr. America, where it says right here, mm-hmm. names involved, Putnam Police Department, right? Is what yes. you put there yes. in the name of requester is optional. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> this is very bad. You know, we went to... <laughs> yeah, that's terrible. We went to um, Citrus Police Department in Rhode Island, and we made them remove an unconstitutional sign that they had right there on the wall um what they should do is put a new sign that says all individuals entering restricted area which would be after this door yeah. would be searched would be subject to search, search of their belongings. because you will be in a restricted area okay. but you'd not be, the you'd building be, you'd itself be, you'd be breaking the law you know what i'm saying if you were in a restricted area no, if you're in a restricted area and 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 you're required to be searched, I guess there's no way around it. But this right here is a public area. It's a public lobby. Yeah, you can't. We, where's where's the Constitution when you need it, right? for all the police so technically this is actually for our so this is very tricky we have to find we, we, we have to be careful how we file this um this public records request because we need to we need to find out if that's a if that policy is like on the books first if it's not just a sign that people just print it and post and put it right there on the wall. Are you a police officer, sir? No. Okay, thanks. Yeah, okay, we'll get you in. Officer, real quick, just one second. Is this a policy or a law? That's our policy for safety and security as we bring people into the building. Okay. Okay, okay but that, it, that's... In the restricted area, not in the public area, right? No, no, this is the public area. Okay, okay. It's a little bit confusing because it says the building. You know, this is part of the building, too. Entering. Okay. 
Just wondering about our Fourth Amendment. That's it. <laughs> Okay. But thank you very much. Your name and batch number? I'm uh, Chief of Police. Chief. Oh, yes. nice to meet you, Chief. All right, I'm Enrique. Nice to meet you, Enrique. Very good. Okay. You take care, all right? All right. Thanks. All right. Um, just the back is for authorized personnel only. Restricted okay. area. Yes. All right, all right cool, so cool. Can I, can I just grab one more uh, Apple request, please? One more what? Uh, public request form, please. Sure. I messed up on this. I just need a new one, please. Okay. Uh, 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 a uh, FOI request? Uh, the public yeah, whatever it's called over here, it's called differently in different states. This request, right? FOIA? Yeah, FOIA. Yeah. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yep. Thank you, boss, man. It says you're not a cop no more. I'm just kidding. I would have let him in on the badge. <laughs> Bucket boy always saying something out of out of hand. <laughs> but that's what the First Amendment is all about, controversial well, speech. Well, luckily, the, the, chief, the chief of police came out here at the Putnam uh, Connecticut Police Department, and he clarified he, that he, for he us very, very nicely and respectively how the way it should be uh, mentioned how this is only for restricted areas. It is a little confusing for those people that don't know their rights. They might face the, possi they might face the possibility of, of getting their rights violated. So um, for those of you traveling in Putnam, Connecticut, for the most part, I think this entire area, for the most part, there were a few things that were out of place, but nobody's perfect. But however, for the most part, I think this entire Putnam area passed. 